You're watching Let's Chat. If your furry friend, four-legged best friend, is in need of some help, we have the place for you. Pet Medic Urgent Care is here to tell us all about the services they offer and how you can get your pet treated right away. Dr. Ariel Hudson and Joshua Singer are here to tell us all about it. Thank you guys for making the time to be here. Thanks yeah. so much for having us. So remind me, what is the difference between a veterinary urgent care practice and a general practice or just an emergency clinic? So I think that probably the main difference is we're not kind of doing those routine things like yearly vaccines, heartworm tests that you're going to have done every year. We're there for, hey, your dog or your cat is sick and we're going to get you in the same day and get you seen and see if we can get you answers and get the dog help. What are some typical things that you see people coming into or, you know, concerned pet parents worried about? Yeah, I think a lot of times we see, hey, my dog's been vomiting or they just mm -hmm. started limping today or, hey, they've started coughing. So some of those things that we're seeing routinely and hopefully getting answers for that day. That is awesome. Remind me, what services do you guys offer in general? Yeah, so we offer, we do exams. We can do any routine blood work and even some more advanced blood works to get to those diagnostics. Um, we have x-rays, ultrasounds, um, and if, if we're able to, we can do some small surgeries on your pets as well. What can owners expect when they visit your clinic? So they'll be greeted by one of the receptionists that'll take them to the room and then a technician will come in and grab a history from the, from the owner um, and then they'll grab some vitals on the pets. After that, they'll come grab one of the doctors. We'll come and do our exam, um, talk to the owners about our findings and develop a treatment and diagnostic plan for their pet. And when did you guys open? You're very recent to um, the newest location in Chattanooga. Yeah. We just opened in July in Chattanooga. Um, there are a number of other pet medic urgent care throughout the country, but this one just opened in July. And where did you decide to open this practice? So we're over off Shalliford Road, um, kind of where Shalliford and Gun Barrel intersect. So a really central location, and the, I feel like everybody knows in Chattanooga, Shalliford. How can owners contact you or book an appointment? It's really easy. You can do it online so they can call the clinic um, or they can go online and there's an easy way to book and it's petmedicurgentcare.com. That is amazing. So remind me again, non-emergency situations, what are really you guys seeing and people, I already mentioned this a moment ago, pet owners concerned, worried about how can you guys kind of ease those concerns? Um, so we're seeing a lot of things like vomiting and diarrhea um, if their pets just aren't quite acting right, sure. which could be anything from some internal disease going on to anything like a musculoskeletal disorder that's causing them pain. Um, but really, it, I think it's about bringing your pet in so that we can figure out what's going on with your pet, determine if it is something that is truly an emergency and if we need to refer you to an emergency clinic um, or if we can get you your pet on some medications that get, and get their treatment started to get them feeling better. And that is great because this is same day care, same day treatment. It's not like you're having to wait hours and hours at a clinic to get treated. Are there any sort of size requirements for the pets, dogs, cats, or any other restrictions that pet parents need to know about? We'll see them all. So we'll see dogs, cats. I don't like snakes. So we'll see snakes. <laughs> don't bring the snakes. Don't bring the snakes. Yeah. I'm right there with you. But any sort of four-legged animal that is, could probably work. Is there any other last-minute information you guys wanted to know or let the viewers know ahead of time before they head out to your clinic and just how they can get their pet treated? Yeah, I think the, I think the biggest thing is we're there for them. So yeah. we're there to help. We want to augment kind of what your general practice is doing and make sure that your pet is receiving care as quickly as possible. And in addition to being at a convenient location, you're also open for weekend or evening appointments, which I think is so spectacular for people who are just needing to find somewhere that's going to be open and take care of their pet, even if it's not a dire emergency situation, but their pet is sick and they're like, what in the world is going on? You guys can help them out. Are there any social media channels or other places people can contact you? Uh, we're on Facebook, but typically the best way to contact us is by calling us or booking an appointment, an appointment online with us. Awesome. Um, so you can always call us at 423-225-7429. <laughs> Thank you so much, Dr. Ariel Hudson and Dr. Joshua Singer, for making the time to be here this morning, telling us about how you can keep your pet safe if your pet is showing any of these symptoms that we just mentioned. These are the guys that you want to take care of them and your family. For more information, stay ahead here with us on Let's Chat.